She wants attention. Hi everyone, really quick video today, but I got some information from Asia this morning and I wanted to share it basically immediately because it is sort of unprecedented. It is a collaboration between two very well-known luxury houses that has never happened before and I kind of can't believe that it is happening because like, okay, so luxury collaborations have happened before. For instance, there was the really famous Gucci Balenciaga Hacker Project that was a while ago. There was Fendace, obviously, with Fendi and Versace. Fendi just had a collaboration with Tiffany for their 25th anniversary for the baguette. Like, luxury brands do collaborations with each other, not infrequently. But there are a few luxury brands that really don't do collaborations. For instance, Chanel, Louis Vuitton, Hermes. Now Louis Vuitton does do artist collaborations though. In fact, they currently have the Yayoi Kusama collaboration going on like right now between Yayoi Kusama and, and Louis Vuitton, the artistic collaboration that is kind of a revival of a collaboration they did with her a while back. And so it's a not unheard of for even Louis Vuitton to do artistic collaborations, even though they don't usually work with other brands. Chanel certainly doesn't collaborate with other design houses, to my knowledge. And so you've probably seen the title in the thumbnail, but Louis Vuitton and Chanel are doing a collaboration with each other. And I kind of can't believe it, but I got the source straight from Asia, and you know that I get a lot of my information from Asia. This was from uh, China and Japan, and I had two different people reach out to me to let me know about this upcoming collaboration with some like sneaky sneak hint preview pictures which I'm going to be sharing with you and I, I really, I, I genuinely can't believe it. Now it looks like it's going to be a very limited run of pieces and I'm not sure if it's going to be sold by Louis Vuitton or Chanel. That is, remains to be seen and it also remains to be seen what material these items are going to be made out of because right now I'm seeing a medium classic flap in Louis Vuitton monogram, a mini rectangular in Louis Vuitton monogram, and a walk in Louis Vuitton monogram. And they told me that there also might be some SLGs that are Chanel-esque in Louis Vuitton monogram. Now, I also don't know if these items are going to be made out of Louis Vuitton canvas and just made in the Chanel quilting, like the medium classic flap looks to be, or if it's going to be painted. Now, Chanel does do a lot of painted pieces. They have done painted bags in the past, the famous newspaper print, for instance, the famous watercolor collection, the airline collection. They've, they've painted bags before with patterns and colors. So I would guess, like this is my, just as my guess, that this is going to be a leather bag that is going to have the Louis Vuitton monogram painted upon it as opposed to being made of Louis Vuitton canvas. Because while, while I don't know for sure, the idea of a medium classic flap or a Chanel walk or a Chanel mini rectangular made of a Louis Vuitton canvas, that I don't, I don't know if Chanel would go that, quite that far. Now, aside from the leaked photos and the fact that there's going to be a collab at all, I don't have a lot of other information. I don't know when it's supposed to be coming out, uh, release dates, anything like that. I, I don't even know materials. Although again, I do suspect that the medium classic flap is going to be made out of leather and painted as opposed to be made out of Louis Vuitton canvas. But don't quote me on that, I don't know. So the last piece of information I do have to share with you from my Japanese contact, I'll put it on the screen over here and then I'll obviously I'll translate. And it says, April Fool, which roughly translates to be April Fools. Have a great day, everybody.